Welcome to today's video. Today's video is going to be a DIY how to do this tumbler cup mug or anything you want for your vinyls and your painting of mugs for your small business. Um, tumbler holder, cup holder, anywho, whatever you want to call it. This is how you do it and let's get started. Do this tumbler holder um, with all these following items that I'm going to show you. It's easier to have one of these instead of completely being flat on a table. And I'm going to show you what would you need. You need elbows that have half inch, the 90 degrees, and you also need these other ones. These are called side outlet 90 degrees as well these are also half inch like half inches like the the the, the uh, circle here you'll need pipe and this is also half an inch pipe they had these already cut i bought my stuff at a home depot they had a little stand where they already had these already cut in this size if you want to buy a bigger one then you can I can remember the price of this ones. I put it down in the description box what each thing cost me. And then I also got these rubber leg tips. They also have them in pipe material. But I think these ones are best because they have rubber and it won't damage your table or wherever that you're working on. These are the materials that I bought everything at the Home Depot. And you will also need a, um, a pool noodle. And that's like one of these. I, I use this one for a Christmas craft. That's why it has this stripey thing. But I had it, so I, I had it. You can get it at the at the dollar store. They have it at the dollar store. These ones are the thinner ones. So you gotta you gotta make sure that your pipe fits through there perfectly. You see, it's just fine. Um, and also your besides that you you'll need one of these cutters well my husband's a plumber so he has this already in hand it cuts the pipes um really easily so you don't have a jaggedy edge i don't know if you would be able to cut it with the handsaw or something like that if um you don't have it but it's easy to install and to put together you're of course going to need a scissors to cut the poo noodle and then we can go ahead and get started this one's right here. I got it in a a a, a big uh, tub here. Somebody wanted to open it, but it's not completely open. It has a 30 pack in here. And this one's they actually didn't come in a bag. We actually got just a little bag there for to easier so it wouldn't be tumbling around the cart. These are uh, sold separately, like singled. So they're like 90. 94 cents or something like that I can't remember uh, but these ones they if you're lucky maybe you will find a little bag like a packet of this but i didn't see one the half inch i didn't see one and this one's like i told you this one was in another area and another it wasn't next to all of these material it wasn't another area uh that you can find this is a three quarters of an inch but i'm thinking it'll fit because it's rubber you can easily put it there um so there's that so now let's get started so you're gonna measure your pvc pipe you're gonna need two pieces of 12 inches so you measure it with a ruler or whatever 12 inches you can see the mark he already made right there and now he's gonna go ahead and and cut uh, with the PVC cutter. Then, after the two 12 piece inches, you're gonna need four three inch pieces. One, two, three. So, one, two, three, four four inch pieces and then cut them again with the PVC cutter. What else can they cut if they don't have a PVC cutter? A hexaw. A hexaw. Mm -hmm. But this one is Whoa. and it's cut. And this one hard. cuts um flush. It's really soft and I'm thinking with the hexaw you can have those jaggedy lines. Yeah. And 
you just assemble it but we need to cut the put noodle as well those are going to be 10 inches to go into your 12 inch pipes Mm -hmm. 10 inch. 10 inch. He's measuring too because I'm a PVC cutter. See if that works. <laughs> Mine had tape because of my Christmas craft. That's why um, it looks like that. But um, you can obviously cut that off. But you get your piece of your. Thing. I'm gonna find this. These were not next to the PVC pipes. They had though. They had. Um, they have the end cap. What are they called? Caps that are the same material, but they will damage your table. So the rubber ones are better because you do press onto your tumbler or your cup or your mug, whatever you're doing. You do press on it. So these has a grip and it won't slide and it won't damage your table you can see you so sliding it. out the sizes so it becomes easier two twelves four three inches two uh 90 degree elbows and these are half inch everything's half inch and two of the side outlets 90 degree angle as well and of course your two uh rubber leg tips and your two 11 inch or 10 inch uh poo noodles and then go like this one side is like this i'm gonna you use two of your outlets here at the bottom insert your noodle inserting noodle bottoms is the elbow then we use these little three inches top and bottom and then the two of them are your feet on the bottom oopsie <laughs> I put that one in the wrong spot this one's here so it becomes your leg to your leg I ran a little bit short on my on my pipe uh, on my pipe not my pipe cleaner on my pool noodle thing. Then we put the rubber tip or the rubber leg tip. You don't need no sort of uh, glue or nothing. It just you're just assembling something to it, you know. And there you go. You see, this one seems a little bit longer. I don't know. <laughs> My husband cut these and he cut them shorter. I don't know why, but you can obviously put it however size. And then I now have two, and they can work fine with longer ones or smaller ones or like. In case like a beer mug then you're able to do the beer mug and just place your decal and and move it and you see it's completely there and it helps you have a better view of where you're putting your decal from top to bottom from this either, either thing tumblers or mugs or the plastic cups is useful to have instead of the ones that they make that are like this it's basically the same table it's just higher and like this you're able to view more of your design and we spend it works like in my mug you can see you can place it easier in a mug it won't slide it's perfectly fine and in case like I'm doing this one this is a little um, I have in my shop already a little water juggy thing here to hold it like this instead of going the other way around also paint mugs so having something like this also helps me to paint 
the mugs and or to put the cult in a mug just like how I did the Little Mermaid but yeah that is how you do one of these I actually saw it in a TikTok video so I we replicate but yeah that is how it's made and in the description box you'll find um, the prices for each thing and comment down below if you like this kind of video and subscribe if you haven't done so and if you already did thank you very much and i will see you next time goodbye